Hello, Leo. It's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly reading in the week of January 30th through February 6th, 2024. <laughs> I wanted to say 22. Wow. The cards I'm using today are Energy and Spirit Oracle by Sandra and Taylor. And I'm closing off with, with oh, clumsy. Uh, quick answers to everyday questions. Easy Lenormand, Marcus Katz, and Tally Goodwin. Okay. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. All right, Morphos, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Leo? Okay, y'all, I'm going to cut it first. Leo, 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 what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so I'm do that in a second. Let me fix these candles real quick. So when I was just doing the Leo, I heard Aries. And when I did the Aries, I was um, hearing and feeling Leo. So for some of you guys, the Leo and the Aries are connected. Maybe somebody in Leo Aries or Aries Leo. Um, but... That's all I can do is tell you what I feel and what I see. Um, and I guess I just did that while I was rechanging these candles. But I'm scared of those other two things. Because they may break. Hopefully they don't, but they might. Yes. All right. Hmm. Entanglement, emotional influence. Mm. So it looked like somebody may be talking in your ear. You're talking to somebody else's ear. And I do feel like um, somebody may be trying to make you feel some type of way or make somebody feel some type of way about you. Okay. Um, yes. Don't really care for those kind of people. Um, trying to, I feel like somebody's trying to make somebody like somebody or dislike somebody. Okay. Oh, well, this person did this and this person did that. You shouldn't be around them, you know, or, oh, that person don't like nobody. You don't want to go talk to them, you know. So I do feel like somebody's trying to persuade um, you to not like somebody. You might be trying to persuade somebody not to like somebody else. Okay. Mm. Like, shoot, just give them a chance. If, if, if it's real, they're going to get it. Okay. They're going to see that that person is not somebody need, they need to be around. Okay. But it, it's not cool when you try to push a dislike for somebody on somebody else. Okay. PTSD moment. My sister used to do that to me all the time and never, it worked when I was young, young, but when I became a teenager, it didn't work no more. It's just like, but I like that person. You know what I'm saying? But it's like somebody's trying to push someone to dislike somebody else or like somebody else. Can't do that. Let them do it they self. Let it all work itself out. Like, that controlling stuff is annoying to me. So, we got card number 42 here. So, success and new opportunities. Oh. Okay. So, I do feel like somebody may be doing this because they want something from you or want something from the person. Maybe want something that you have. Okay. So, you might be the successful person and somebody is trying to get other people not to like you because of your success okay so jealousy is a hundred percent here <laughs> here and now i promise okay <laughs> all right so sensitivity and strength tapping uh the forces within okay um so i do feel like of course somebody already know what's gonna happen will know what's happening and it's crazy like when people do like weird stuff to me or I know they after me or they're getting ready to try to do something to me, I can look at them and I can tell in their face all the time. 
if they up to something crazy or not okay um but i do feel like if you don't usually get this you're gonna get this when these people are um trying to come get you for whatever reason um you're gonna see it in their face it's like a guilt look or it's like a, a caught look when you turn around and look into their face or they be looking at you like in disgust and you turn around like, you know, what the, why are you looking like that? You know what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm feeling here. Tap it within forces. So it's just like, believe yourself, trust in yourself. If you think that somebody may not have care for you, um, just trust that your, your, your thoughts are true. Okay. Trust, trust that your thoughts are complete. They true. They real. What the heck? All right, I heard the name Manny, M-A-N-N-Y. I don't know what that is, but we're going to keep going. I don't know what that is. I'm trying to figure it out, but we're going to keep going. So we got card number 20. So hope, optimism, and new beginnings. So I do feel like, yeah, somebody got a new start. Somebody got a good loud I hope good outlook on everything that is going on. I do feel like somebody just got nothing but success ahead of them. Okay, but definitely got some green eyed goblins, green eyed monsters uh after you. Um and I, of course they want what you want. That's just it. That's what's going on here. Um, but this is like the keep going, keep having hope, keep being you. Just trust your intuition, okay? If you feel like you shouldn't tell somebody something, don't tell somebody something. If you feel like you should, don't, okay? Just stay away from the people you know not to trust, okay? You get that feeling, trust that feeling, okay? All right, so personal guide, guardian angel spirit guide, okay? So, of course, you got somebody that's there and protecting you. I do feel like this person is sending you messages and stuff. Um, I do feel like you might get sent places um, purposely, okay? Uh, so, it's like, oh, I forgot my pen here, okay? I usually don't forget my pen, so I go get my pen and I hear somebody talking crap. Or I uh, see I left my email open or I see I left you know, um, something of mind somewhere and like somebody was getting ready to do some weird stuff with it. Um, and I feel like nick of the time I caught them. I do feel like you got an angel placing, putting you in places where you're getting this information that you need to stay away from these, um, dangerous people. Okay. They're danger to your lifestyle, even if it's not like physically. Okay. Yeah. Mm, I feel like this person definitely got a good a good spirit is a good person, but it's like dealing with somebody who is mostly jealousy just trying to bring them down, okay? All right, up from the depths, releasing uh difficulties. Um so I feel like Ah, this one is hard. I feel like I'm trying to let this go. I'm trying to let things go that, that are going on and people are doing to me. So it's like I, I see what's going on and I'm trying to let it go and it's hard for me to let it go. Okay, so to let it go and move forward. Um, I do feel like it could be the why is why is hard for me to let go. It's just like, why do you do this to me? Why do you feel like I want to understand it? You know, sometimes you just don't get an understanding, okay? Because most of the times, the feelings of dislike for you come from another person. So it's like, at least let me do something to you, okay? At least let me do something to you, okay? Let's keep going. But I do feel like, of course, this person has something against you that has nothing to do with um, who you are as a person, just what you have done. Oh, I guess it is who you are as a person and what you have. But there's nothing wrong with you. You know that. But it's still hard to feel like there's nothing wrong with me. I remember when I realized that uh, people just don't like you for some reasons. And that's just that. You can't. There's no answer to it. <laughs> they just don't. Okay. It's weird, but it just, just don't. All right. So we got phases of entanglement. So this is how we started, you know. This is why these people got issues with you. Um, 
I do feel like somebody is dealing with their own insecurities and they're taking this situation out on you. You could be doing this to somebody else too. Um, but I do feel like I'm pushing um, you not to like somebody, somebody not to like you because of what's wrong with me. Okay. And then I feel like we got the followers who don't even know why they, I just like this person. Um, but I do feel like they're just doing it just to be a part of the clique, the gang, the, 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 you know, whatever that is. Mm. all right so we got talent guides spirit mentors well, i don't think i ever seen this card spirit mentors and teachers okay so we got card number 41 here so i do feel like um this is just a card of being yourself i do feel like you real talented i do feel like you're gonna end up winning those uh people or that person over um but i also feel like the the main person you know every year we always know who the main person is um just keep your eyes on them because they will never um be on the level of forgiveness with you because i mean their problem is deep within they self okay it's deep within their self mm. Um, yeah, but I do feel like things are getting better for you. Skills are getting better. And I do feel like people are going to start seeing who you really are and what you really can do. Okay. I do feel like somebody's going to start liking you for um, who you are, even though um, you got this person trying to persuade them uh, to be against you, to work against you. Okay. So let's keep going for the Leo. Let's we'll see what's going on. Uh, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, Leo, Leo, Leo. Ooh, Leo. I feel like I forgot to do something. Leave that there. Okay, let's see what's on the end. Mm. All right, so we got card number 20, networking. Okay, so this makes me feel like I'm um, getting ready to start getting closer to people. Um, I do feel like somebody, people are starting to see more who I am. I do feel like new beginnings, new structure is coming for me. Um, I do feel like stability, definitely stability is happening here. Okay. Um, yeah, I do feel like the social parties, people getting together, coming together, um, understanding, you know, I mean, what's really going on, what it really is, okay? All right, so we got card number 29 here. So this makes me feel like the intuition card, new beginning, mental clarity. So it's like I'm, I know you're getting ready to get the energy where you're going to know what's going on. You're going to know what to do. Um, I do feel like this is going to lead in victory. So just keep moving forward with what you're doing, okay? Do feel like success and victory is coming to you okay just trust your intuition so we got the eight here so i do feel like try to walk away that's the energy that i was getting from here try to walk away from a situation walk away from uh what you felt about a person or what you feel about a person um what you know what this person is doing but of course just keep that eye open okay we got this moon card this halfway i do feel like this is what this person has done to you or is doing to you is definitely going to come out, okay? Um, I feel like I did not lie. I feel like people were being persuaded, but they didn't realize what was going on. But you know, when somebody doing shady stuff, it always come out, slip out, and then people start putting pictures together, putting things together like, oh, you don't like this person because blah, 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 blah. Not because they did something bad to you, okay? So it's going to come out, okay? Mm-hmm. See it for what it is. All right. So we got card number 35 here. Hold up. Why did I see this already somewhere? Okay, maybe it came up somewhere else. Um, but we have uh card number 35. The nine of swords i do feel like somebody is uh, keep thinking about this, very worried about this. I do feel like this puts somebody in like a um paranoid uh state of mind but i do feel like somebody is not doing anything wrong so of course you can only try to keep doing what you're doing um but of course it's gonna be hard to when you know you know these people didn't try to um come after you okay but definitely the stability is there for you um so just try not to worry and just keep doing what you what you do keep doing what you know to do 
All right, so we got, oh, card number 20. I think that was already at the end. So networking, you know, just get around, talk to people, you know, be who you are, and they're going to see that you're not the person that this person is trying to persuade you as, and everything will be okay. All right, but other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.